So, today's video topic is porn is killing your sexual health. Okay, very important video topic that I am dropping for you guys today. So, we're going to be talking about porn, masturbation, okay? That shit that millions of men are doing in this society. Okay, so listen, believe it or not, a lot of you guys think y'all are slinging. A lot of you guys think y'all are um, operating at your best full potential in the bedroom. And um, if you are still watching porn, I promise you, you are not. So let me tell you what's happening to you when you watch porn, right? We're not going to talk about the spiritual uh, effects or the physical effects. We are going to talk about the health effects of watching porn and masturbating. So I want you to understand, right? When you condoning that satanic ritual, right? We all masturbated before, all right? But pay attention to how hard you are squeezing your meat. You be squeezing that shit like this and just going. And also, don't be immature. I'm, I'm speaking on some real shit. You can't be immature on my page, bro. We as men, bro. You feel me? Women be watching this shit. You feel me? I'm an intelligent God. I'm a man. You feel me? I'm just here to help. You feel me? Don't be on that. Oh, you on that sus shit, gay shit. Y'all chill with that fool shit. You feel me? So listen, you be squeezing your meat so hard, fam. And you are killing your sexual health. This is why a lot of you guys got erectile dysfunction. All right? A lot of you guys got erectile dysfunction. Okay, all because you beat your meat and masturbate every day, four times a day. Some of you niggas be going ten times a day. Just killing yourself. All right? And I promise you, you are not operating at your best in bed, bro. Women want a meat that's hard, firm. You feel me? She want a man that can get up. A lot of you guys have programmed your mind to the point where when you get around a real female, a real female, right? A physical female, your meat don't get... On crank, you feel me? It don't get hard, it don't get up. All right, that shit is embarrassing, bro. I've been there before watching that dumbass satanic shit destroying my sex, sexual health. So I'm telling you, cuz a lot of you guys have been in situations where you've been with women, a bad woman, right? And you're around these women, but you're not getting excited, you're not getting cranked. You get what I'm saying? So she could have been kissing you just that in the third, it could be time to fuck her pussy dripping, whatever the hell. You look down there, your shit is, and I'm not saying yours is this size, but your shit is like not growing, none of that. It's like no blood is flowing through there. So now you at this point where you like, damn, fuck. So now the bitch gotta do all this extra shit, like give you head, just to make you crank. And then on top of that, after she give you head and you get that little energetic boost, because you know, if you ever got head before, it feels great. So it's gonna give you some type of erection. This is the facts. So now you can't fuck her how you want to, but you still wanna fuck, but you can't get up. So now the bitch gotta give you head to crank and get on hard mode. That's embarrassing. So now the bitch giving you head, this unnecessary head for like, whatever the fuck. So now you cranking, you finally get your little mm, so you can, it can be, a little firm to go in properly right now what's interesting about this don't cap a lot of you guys after she did that to you you was fucking that shit for about maybe two minutes five minutes and then all of a sudden your meat getting back on soft now you got to tell her to give you head again just to get like a little oomph now that's embarrassing so let me tell y'all something porn is killing your sexual health it's killing your sexual health bruh as a man, right, you supposed to be ready to go if a female wants to do such and such with you. This is the facts, like, and believe it or not, after that situation that played out when you couldn't get up, your shit wasn't on hard, she had to give you head a whole bunch of times just to keep you hard, like y'all couldn't do multiple positions without her giving you head, bruh, that's embarrassing, cuz she might not never fuck you again for real. This is the facts, I'm speaking from experience, I'm not trying to like, Bash you nigga, don't feel ashamed. We men, I'm here to uplift and teach men the real shit. Fuck that shit. I'm here to teach you how to become a man. Okay, because watching porn, you still a little boy, boy. You still a little boy. You a little boy. Yeah. <laughs> so listen. Porn is killing your sexual health, cuz. 
bro, when a female, right, wants to do this and that with you, cub, before she even think about doing it, your shit gotta already be, it's supposed to crank immediately. If it ain't doing that, it's a problem. Your sexual health is not good, bro. You beat your meat and you program your mind to this fantasy, this illusion that's not real. So when you get real women, real women, you don't know what you you don't know what to do. Your brain is so used to getting erections from the phone that when it's time to get the real thing, you excited, but your meat down there not excited because you depleted. You done squeezed so much blood. You done squeezed your meat to hell. So now it's not cranking. It's not cranking. <laughs> Bro, that's the most embarrassing shit, dawg. So this is what I'm trying to tell y'all. Porn is killing your sexual health. You are not operating at your best watching porn and beating your meat all day. I don't give a fuck who you think you is, bro. You could be fucking her way better if you just stop watching porn, man. Stop watching porn. Stop beating your meat, man. I'm telling you, a man who's... A man who's disciplined, been celibate, whatever the fuck. Because it's like... You're in control of your erections, right? But sometimes, naturally, it just come. That's how it's supposed to be. So when you get around a real female, right, at any given time, and she wanted to do what and what, you out the gates. That's how it's supposed to be. She don't got to give you no damn head or none of that to crank, bruh. So out the gates, you crank, bruh. She ain't got to wait to do none of that. You could just flap, 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 get it in. You feel me? She gonna be more turned on by that. She feel me? Believe it or not, when a female can sense that you're ready to go, you make her ready to go. Cause nine times out of ten, if you a man, right, and you discipline, a woman is more. Don't worry about the background. A woman is more ready to go than you are. Okay? This is the facts. When you focus on your ground and purpose, a woman is more ready to go than you are. Okay? They love a man on their purpose, bro. So her pussy be getting wet just seeing you grinding, fam, and not worrying about it. She be ready to fuck you. And she don't even know why. It's just something about this nigga just staying disciplined and just, like, getting better, bro. That shit turn holes on, fam. This is masculinity, the dynamics of masculinity. So porn is ruining, ruining your sexual health. The more you masturbate, the more you watch porn. Because you are killing your sexual health. You can't crank, you can't get up. Your dick not gonna be the hardest when you fucking her. You think you going crazy, but you gotta understand, women is, they can feel how hard you really are. So to your perspective, right, you thinking you, like you, you the man down there, like you really, and you may be kind of pleasuring her, right? But it's not something for her to remember. You get what I'm saying? So listen, what I'm trying to tell you is, if you want to improve your sex life, your sexual health, you got to stop watching porn. The moment you stop watching porn, the moment you stop killing yourself and draining your own energy and squeezing that shit so hard all the time, it's going to go back to normal. It's going to be more plump. It's going to be more plump. You're going to be more full with life. You're going to be way more full with life. So it's like your shit going to be way harder because you're not abusing yourself. Okay? The Bible tell you, masturbation leads to destruction. This is the facts. It's the facts. It leads to destruction. It destroys you on every level. You weak, you tired, you can't think. You can't fuck a bitch how you want to. She gotta give you head multiple times just to stay up. Like imagine you hitting this hoe for two, two, two three minutes. Two, three minutes, you better, and then your shit just inside the pussy gets soft. You know how she thinking, bro? She getting turned off, bro? Huh? What? She like, what the fuck, huh? She getting turned off, bro? Imagine you hitting the hole, right? And I'm speaking from like experience, bro. You hitting the hole. You hitting her. Now, nah, this is not every time. This is like certain situations. But I'm speaking from experience because every man in his life got trapped by society. Oh, oh, oh. That instant gratification. Every man has done it, but I'm speaking. I don't do it no more, bitch. I'm celibate. I'm grinding. You get what I'm saying? I have, bro, I will never do that shit again. I'll never dishonor my ancestors like that. Ancestors slap the shit out of me. Y'all do some shit like that. You feel me? 
it's motherfuckers that's always around you watching your every move watching your life people who care about you don't disrespect don't disrespect them or disgrace them watching that demonic shit man go get the real thing or hold it in and go grind bro what the fuck so listen i'm speaking from experience imagine you hitting a female bop, 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 and she can feel you losing that that hardness that's that sh that plumpness bro and now you gotta stop and tell her give me head just to get that because bro that's embarrassing bro that's embarrassing as fuck fam it is but let me tell you something when you in that shit and you and your shit just rock solid for like 10 15 minutes straight and it never gets off it's the same like it's the same strength same power nigga she be getting wet bro she gonna be getting wet because it's not getting soft. You gonna make her more turned on because it's consistent. But when you be jacking off and masturbating, you you can't even stay on hard in the pussy. It's crazy because you supposed to be hard once you get in the pussy. It's like the pussy is supposed to keep your shit stimulated. But when you watch porn, I promise you, you be getting in that shit. And yo, you in the pussy, you in the real thing and your shit be hard. You be going crazy. And then your shit just start getting like soft and shit and now she's like what the fuck it's interrupting the rhythm you know it's a rhythm when you have sex it's a rhythm it's a rhythm what the fuck who the fuck it's even embarrassing for you as well because it's like you be hitting that hoe dun, 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 dun. and then you know if your meat is not on hard the pleasure goes away so it's like fuck so it's embarrassing bro y'all gotta stop watching porn Porn is killing your sexual health, fam. It really is. It's killing your sexual health. It's making you not operate at your best, fam. A lot of you guys don't even know what's y'all best because y'all still watch porn. Y'all ain't never get to lay the wood on a female for real. When you stop doing that shit, like a lot of you guys be fucking so much hoes and you fucking these hoes at your lowest self like you don't you're not giving her the the brick you're not giving her the brick bro and i'm not telling you to go celibate bro that's a choice you do what the fuck you want to do that shit is the truth though but listen you don't have to do practice semen. i'm telling you you should all men should but i'm a lot of y'all ain't gonna do it anyway so what i'm gonna tell you is this bro just stop watching porn that's it for me it's causing you to have social anxiety the list goes on bro i talk about this shit daily but I never talk about the sex part of it. So I decided to do that in this video. So listen, if you don't want to be on the celibate shit, you still want to fuck hoes, at least stop looking at the flicks, fam. Like, if you can fuck hoes, go fuck hoes, cuz. Go fuck you some females. Go fuck the real thing. Don't, whenever you get that urge, oh, yeah, because you feel guilty. Your spirit gonna tell you, after you masturbate and you bust that little, how you feel? guilty you feel ashamed like why did i do that and then the women that you was looking at on that screen you don't even really like them so in that moment a spirit took over your ass a spirit walked in your body and was like yes give me that energy took your shit and then after the spirit got your energy you came back to your senses after you busted that pointless nut on a fucking phone screen bro hey listen One thing I want to say is this, bro. I would never in my life fuck with a nigga who masturbate. I swear to God on everything, I'll never fuck with a nigga who masturbate, bro. I feel your energy. You are a no life. You are a weirdo. You give off pervy energy. It's on you, bro. You think people don't? You think people can't pick up on that? You're a perv, fam. And you're not even trying to be a perv, but you done programmed your mind and fucked your vessel up so bad and fucked your energy, your temple up that when people look at you, they can see that you are a perv. They can look you in the eyes and say, and just tell that there is something off about you. You're doing something behind closed doors you got no business doing. People can look you in the eyes and you give them the, the weird, like, ugh. But they won't tell you though, cuz. I'm telling you, cuz, y'all gotta stop quick. Y'all, bro, y'all gotta stop, boy. The ancestors is not fucking with you niggas who wanna. You niggas who still wanna masturbate, I promise you, boy, your ass is not making it to 2030, boy. Your ass is not making it. When that solar flare hit this hole, you ain't jumping densities. You ain't activating shit. Your ass is gonna burn out like a star. 
spontaneous combustion. You think this shit is a game? All you motherfuckers who, who can't let go of porn, y'all think this shit is a fucking game. Listen, that sun in the sky gonna get your ass up out of here. Oh, you still wanna... Oh, you still wanna watch demonic shit, huh? But it's a choice, though. You do you. In the end, it's gonna cost you your damn life, even though death ain't real, but you not gonna be ill. You gonna get burned up, cuz. It's all designed by nature. Y'all gotta break free of that demonic shit, cuz that shit is so satanic. Listen, everybody who be on porn, who be fucking, it's rituals, fam. Like, even if they don't even do witchcraft, it's rituals, folk. It be rituals done in the video. Like, before it's recorded, why do you think the scene, the scripting, all that shit is to program and destroy your mind? Listen, you know, them, them people that be fucking in the scenes, right? You know they're reading a script. So to you, it's like, you think it's real life, but even that shit is fake, fam. Like, everything they say in there, like, a bitch could be like, yeah, do this and that to me, daddy, da 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 It's a script. It's not real. Like, it's like a real deal script, like an act. They be acting while they fucking, fam. That's not how sex really is, bruh. Sex is nowhere near like porn. If you really had sex, bro, you know that shit is not like porn. Porn will give you the whole biggest illusion. It's not real. Everything you see off porn, some of it be like people just at their house fucking and wanting to post it. Just weird shit. People be posting their own porn videos to get money. This is true. They don't be on under no company or that, but all them brazers. <laughs> Pornhub, all the bullshit, the you, the you porn, it goes on and on. Now a lot of people gonna ask, how does he know? I did it. So, man up. I don't do it no more though, and I won't ever do it no more. And that's on the most high, right? So I'm speaking from experience, and I'm trying to help you guys. All right, because we all been there. Because this society is fucked up, but you gotta wake up and break free out of it. It's really a war on men. The more you watch porn, the more these people that you can't see with these two eyes control your life and keep you where you at. The more you watch porn, the more you're gonna stay stagnant. Like, it's real shit, like, you have no idea. The more that you watch porn, you are so easily to be manipulated. You got no willpower. You got no sense of awareness. Like, it's, it's designed to control you. It's designed to control you. Now, many of your car, if you are chosen, I don't give less of a damn. Listen, I'm 1% of men. And I promise you on my life, I will be 1% of 1% of men in this world. In this realm, in this reality, this earth, I am 1% of men. And I'm going to continue to be that. And I'm trying to get you to be on my level. Maybe better. I'm a masculine guy. I'm supposed to be a authority figure. An uplifting, inspiring, motivational figure. You feel me? So I'm not here to derail you. That's pussy ass niggas do that. Pussy ass niggas want to see the next man down. It's unfortunate. I guess it gotta be some pussy niggas in his life. Am I right or wrong? So it gotta be some hoe ass, punk ass niggas, unfortunately. That's just how it is. Only a select few real ones gonna be in his life, you feel me? So yeah, my job is to motivate you and inspire you. Real men, real divine masculine men, we're here to motivate, uplift, and help you become better, fam. That's my goal as a masculine man, a masculine figure. I'm here to teach you and uplift you, bruh. I don't wanna see you fail, man. I wanna see you great, bruh. But I want to say this, any of these fuck niggas, the enemies who are against me, if you want to see me fail, I want to see you fail. That's just how it is. I'm a man. But for the most part, you know, I'm here to uplift y'all. You feel what I'm saying? So listen, porn is killing your sexual health. Porn is killing your sexual health. Y'all got to stop watching that porn, man. I'm chumping, bro. I'm telling you, cuz. Stop, cuz. It's ruining your life, cuz. A lot of people don't want to accept it or believe it. Bro, no hoes want you, cuz. You dry down there. You a no life, fam. You got all the time in the world to, oh, oh, sleep. You sleep. And if you ain't sleep, guess what you finna do? Oh, finna go play the game, finna smoke weed. Oh, finna go chase more hoes after I just busted a nut. Oh, I'm not finna work out. Oh, I'm finna be the same person I, just like I was last year. Oh, I'm not gonna be mature. Oh, all types of bullshit. So listen. Stop watching porn, man. It's killing your sexual health. Women want a nigga who meat or dick can get hard and stay hard the whole time. Every time she fuck you, that shit ready to go. She like that. She like it, bro. Because it shows that you really want her, too. You feel what I'm saying? That, bro, y'all gotta understand, cuz. This is real game. When you get with a female, 
and you decide this female is worth your time and energy and you cram her she's already looking at your print fam just to see if you already cranking just by talking before what happened it's gonna get her wet because she like damn I want this nigga bad too but then when she see that you already ready to go before she touched you she just talking y'all just intimate just having a regular conversation she's gonna get wet bruh because you ready to go too so that signifies to her in her mind oh he wants me like that too so when y'all do it it's gonna be godlike man y'all think this is i'm putting y'all on game i will never lie to y'all boys so listen i'm gonna say this shit one more time porn is killing your sexual health stop watching porn and start fucking the real thing if you can't fuck right now when you shouldn't even have the urgency to fuck, you should have the urgency to get your life together because you niggas is backwards, bro. But do you. You shouldn't even have the urgency to go fuck. You should have the urgency to build your life up, build your physique up, build your mind up, read, learn, grow. Shit that a man's supposed to be doing. That other shit gonna come later, man. You worried about a box. You chasing a box when you a king. You don't even know that you a king, do you? I know I'm a god, you feel me? I don't give a fuck. What hoe watching? Hey, listen, huh? Huh, I'm a god, bitch. And you gonna either treat me like that or you gonna get gone. It's gonna be a bitch. Who do? Because I know my worth. And as a man, you must know your worth. You must know that you are a king. You are the prize, G. There will never be another man like you. Hey, listen, on the most high, there will never be another man like Thuggalon Marco. And I put that on God. Vice versa with you, bro. You gotta know your worth and know where you headed in this life. When you know your worth, people will respect you. Women will respect you. Very key. So look, this video was low key long as fuck, but I had to talk about this important ass video, important ass topic. You know what I'm saying? So look, anyways, I love you guys so much. Y'all stay tuned for more content. Yeah, talk a little more about my game.